How's everybody doing this afternoon? A beautiful day in San Diego. Uh, Carlsbad Village Drive right behind me. That way to the five. That way to the ocean. And I'm in town center, I think. Senior Grubbies is right behind me, right there, Senior Grubbies. Good friend of mine owns that. So anyway, I wanna talk a little bit about the cryptos today and how they're down, and mainly down on the news that Google may not allow the ads, the crypto uh, ads on Google anymore. Much like what Facebook did. So Google, which is the free speech giant, the internet, the openness, and all this other stuff now, says that they don't want to allow ads for cryptocurrencies anymore. Which is kind of interesting because uh, they don't really state any kind of reason for it. Um, basically, they just do the same thing Facebook is, is they just don't want to be a part of it. Or claim they don't want to be a part of it. So. We'll just see how that plays out. But anyway, they're all down because of that reason, which tells me something. Facebook and uh, Google don't take stuff down or take a position like that on anybody else. Um, I mean, anything can get on Google. Um, any kind of weird, crazy, stupid thing can get on Google. But when it comes to cryptocurrencies, everybody wants to turn them off. So you know what that tells me right now? Buying opportunity. Buying opportunity, buying opportunity, buying opportunity. You got them all down right now. You got Bitcoin down. You got EOS down. You got all these opportunities down. And this is the future. In fact, I think uh, I saw today that North Korea, uh, North Korea, South Korea, has come up with a bit uh, a blockchain um, central banking system that they're working on right now. So countries don't go to work on scams. Countries like South Korea, which is very progressive in uh, the internet, in cryptocurrency, is one of the most progressive places in the world. Maybe I might move there if this thing keeps going. But um, a country like that is very progressive, very, very, uh, not unprogressive, they're very, um, they have a forward thinking uh, mentality about this and, and they're all in. So uh, Google and Facebook are simply just, uh, just trying to uh, I think anything they're just trying to get trying to get their trying to get people to think that this isn't anything big which is great that's wonderful i think it's uh, the best thing they could do because it gives everybody like you and me an opportunity somebody that can get into this thing early on and make some money at it and you will make some money at it uh, bitcoin cryptocurrency blockchain open ledger that's the that's your future if you're of this age and you know you're taking a little bit of money and making it into a lot of money. This is the way you're going to do it, investing in investments like this. So don't believe what's going on with the, the downward right now. In fact, if anything, everything else is very positive. It's just that people just want to believe that uh, there's nothing there. And, of course, Google is pretending like they're going to be your daddy and your mommy and protect you from the evil crypto cryptocurrencies or the, uh, the coin offerings and all that stuff like that. But not, not true, not real. It's just making you go along with the with the herd mentality. Just go along with what everybody else thinks. You know that these things are just bad and they're taking people's money, uh, which is not, couldn't be further from the truth. So anyway, if you believe Google, just wait for a few more years, and you'll see this thing take off, and you'll see where if you'd have bought it at a time like now, uh, you'd have made a lot of money. So uh, mark the video. See what happens. Appreciate you watching.